All right, it's Monday, and I'm back on the horse. And I'm gonna be working on his right, let's see, left side of the horse today. I'm trying to get the muscles properly put in. It's a little windy outside. We had uh, snow the other night and uh, it ain't all gone yet. But this southerly wind is going to bring some warm weather in, I think, to get rid of it. All right, I'll be back working on this leg. Now this uh, true form armature is a, an amazing product, but you still have to do a little sculpting of bone structure because it's a, a shorthand of the bone structure. There's a little bulge of bone right there that isn't in the uh, armature. So you got to have that or else the uh, view of the front of the leg ain't going to look right. So you got to still use your knowledge of the anatomy of a horse to uh, get it right. For instance, that little bone isn't in the uh, armature. You have to add that with clay. And... Uh, it's just something you know about. By the way, um, if you get a background noise, my uh, sculpting or my camera is connected to my table here right now. And so it's probably picking up sounds on my cutting board, which it's attached to. I know it's not Halloween now, but I thought I'd give you a little background of my family. We had family that uh, lived in Salem, Massachusetts back in the 1600s. And uh, they, uh, there was a famous judge who judged the uh, witches of Salem. And uh, we're related to that guy, 
can't think of his name right now. There's a statue of him in a square in Salem. I just can't think of his name. And we are related to, uh, or I'm related to, a couple of people who were tried as witches in Salem. So it's an interesting background of my family. We uh, have some of our family that came over on the Mayflower and uh, had a lot to do with the early part of this country. Now I'm gonna do the other side now because I gotta be able to do that chest and the neck and get it all connected up. So I'm gonna have to do the legs or the upper part of the legs first and then, uh, then I can get it all started. I'm just building up the uh, bone structure here. The nice thing about the uh, true form armature is that uh, you don't have to measure where the knee is and uh, all this other all these other measurements because it's already there and uh yeah you have to do a couple of things but you know when you think about it it saves you a whole lot of time and uh i'm all for saving myself time
All right, well, this is going to have to do it for the day. Uh, got the front legs started so got a lot to do I got the chest to do yet and the neck and uh, but at least I've got this much done and uh, I'll fine tune this it's not where I like it yet but it will be before I'm done alright everybody have a great night and I'll see you next time Good night, everybody. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.